If you took, take a peek in the curious mind of him today, you will hear the following curiosity sneak out. How is a treehouse made? Does a scorpion stinger have venom? How much venom? Do stonefish live worldwide? Does a dogfish have poison only in its spine or in its body too? He has a sheer joy of learning new things and knows how to advocate for himself so that he is directed to books and resources on topics he is passionate and curious about. During our nonfiction unit, the student was interested in learning more about animals in the ocean. He read about so many ocean animals, researching to see which of the species he would set up in an ultimate battle. Jerry Colotta, author of Who Would Win book series, would be proud to read the students Who Would Win Colossal Squid vs. Giant Pacific Octopus book. He was very meticulous in his research about which species to put in, into his book. He had a strong desire to uncover and explore new information and have the exact correct species battle it out. While this student reads a book or information about a topic, he becomes even more curious about new topics. I am confident that this student will continu continue to learn about the world around him. He is destined to do great things. He is driven by his curiosity and will no doubt continue to work hard and challenge his learning. I hope you agree with me that Max Warren should earn a exemplifies the definition of hard working. Whether the subject is reading, writing, or mathematics, this student can always be counted on to give 100%. Since the beginning of the school year, the student has always tried her best to meet all expectations and has shown effort in all she has done. However, over the past trimester, we have noticed significant growth in her independence, confidence, and ability to work through things on her own. In math, she has learned many strategies to make her thinking visible through models, equations, and explanations. We are regularly impressed by her perseverance as a, as a mathematician, especially while solving multi-step problems. As a reader and writer, she consistently applies all the strategies she has been taught. This student really shines when she is asked to write about her reading. She consistently makes sense of writing prompts and is able to identify and cre create the graphic organizer that will help her best organize her thoughts. She is able to make strong claims and always goes back to text to find reasons and specific pieces of evidence to support her claims. Additionally, this student puts effort in develop to developing her student skills. She listens attentively, participates in whole group and small group discussions, follows classroom routines, and completes all her homework. She is a positive role model for all of her E1 peers. It is truly a gift to have the opportunity to work with this student each day. We are confident that her effort and perseverance will help her achieve many successes in her life. And this month, the Effort Award goes to Fiona Landon.
thought it would be really nice if we all said goodbye to Jamie and Henry on their very last day because we are going to miss them. Henry, do you want to play something on the piano? No? All right, well, he'll think about it. Maybe he'll do it after. But if everybody were on the count of three, we can say goodbye. One, two, three. Okay.